five weeks ago, uh, Wes Klosser and I had a we're meeting for lunch, and I said something about trying to do a fundraiser, and he said, Senior Center and Meals on Wheels. So with Wes Klosser from Comfort Hospice Care, Tyann James from uh, Nathan Adelson Hospice, and Megan Kowalski, I never remember her last name, from Desert View Hospital, we're all working together to put this event on, and it's all of the proceeds, all of it, will go towards the Senior Center's Meals on Wheels because they do need help. You guys kind of did this in an emergency situation because because of how their need. It, exactly. I didn't realize, and I'm on the phone frequently with Ann, but I didn't know that this was going on, and it just happened to be that it, Wes had just met with Ann, and they were talking about it, and when he and I met and I mentioned wanting to do a fundraiser, that's how this came about, and we knew we had to do it quickly. There's, they've got 30 people on a waiting list. 30. That means there are 30 seniors that are not getting, homebound seniors that are not getting meals that they should be getting. So that's horrible. Meals on Wheels program has grown so much in the last six to eight months that we just needed a little boost, I guess you would call it. And Tanya from Inspirations here and um, Tyann with Nathan Adelson Hospice and Wes with Comfort uh, Hospice and Megan with the Desert View Hospital all got together and decided let's do a fundraiser for this program. And here we are and it's absolutely phenomenal. It's really turning out well. We're really happy. It's a lot of fun here too as well having a Calypso theme. But there's so many good things that the Senior Center does including feeding the seniors every single day. But the Meals on Wheels is important because of why? Well, because the folks that get our Meals on Wheels program are homebound seniors. These are seniors who can't get out of the house, can't come to the Senior Center, can't interact with the other seniors. They have, they're, they're basically stuck at home all the time. And this gives them a me seven meals a week, one meal per day. When we make them at the center, we freeze them, and then we deliver them one, week, one day a week, seven meals each. And we have about 110 people right now we're delivering to, and we have a waiting list that sets about 20 to 21 right now, and this is what this is for, is to hopefully get those people off that waiting list and into the, in the food into their homes. Can the regular public donate? Absolutely. Anybody that would love to donate the, to the program, we would be happy to help, have any help we could get. It's always a help, you know, anything that we get. So they can get in touch with the Senior Center directly? Absolutely. It's 727-5008, 9 to 3.30, Monday through Friday.